Zebra Herd, welcome back to Super Mario RPG. In the last episode, we were able to save Princess Peach from the wedding, and on top of that, we were able to have her join our team. Of course, we'll go and check out the journal as we head into our next area, Star Hill, which is where our next star should be. Whoa, look at this. This place is so pretty. And before we get too far into it, let's take a look at our journal and keep up with what's going on. So right down this way, Chased to Marymore. Princess Peach and Booster's wedding is booked at the hall in Marymore. But the princess doesn't seem to like, she doesn't seem like she wants to get married. Mario looks worried, so we should probably stop it. Wedding Crasher. We saved Princess Peach from the wedding and Booster got to eat a big cake, so everything worked out okay? But we should still get the princess back home to the Mushroom Kingdom. A souvenir photo taken at Marymore. May all your days be joyous ones. Say cheese, that's so cute. And uh, Peach's resolve. Wow, Princess Peach snuck out of the castle and joined the team. I hope the Chancellor doesn't find out. We're gonna go to Tadpole Pond now to ask Grandpa where the next star piece is. All right, very cool. So now that we're all caught up, here we are at Star Hill. And what does the sign say? To Marymore. Talk to the flower and the stargate will open. Huh. Interesting. To Star Hill. We're already in Star Hill. So we'll talk to this flower? Whoa, and then I'll open it up. Was there another flower? There was another flower. Wait a minute. So I can go through the keyhole. And we're out of here. Uh, I'm so confused. It, uh, okay. Uh, I guess it's sort of just our normal exit. I see how it works. <laughs> Very confusing. Let's go ahead and talk to this flower that we go farther into Star Hill. And what's going on in here? This is Star Hill. Wishes, which were transformed at the Star Road, fall to here. But some wishes that haven't been granted yet are falling because Smithy destroyed the Star Road. The Frog Sage mentioned a star piece on this hill. Let's see if we can find it. All right, let's go for it. And over here, we have somebody to talk to. Wish I had some cricket jam. <laughs> what is this? Is this an enemy? It is an enemy, whoa. Okay, so we have Princess Peach here as our first uh, time using her. And whoa, we got the Gecko and the Master Doom. Okay, so we're starting with Peach here. We're gonna just do a normal attack. And she just does a little slap. Whoa, blocking that one, blocking that one. Now it's time for Mario to do an attack. Was a little bit off the timing there, but get rid of one of the Geckos. All right, HP max. Let's use a special thought peek on the gecko. Come on. Got it. And as 92 health, the red one, huh? What happened to the green guy? <laughs> yeah, where's Luigi at? Well, the blizzard coming in from the mass of doom. Let's go ahead and try the slap a little bit. I missed, unfortunate. Whoa, I can't block that, I guess. Put Smalo to sleep. All right, hit the gecko again. Good damage here. I definitely need to wake Malo up if possible. Uh, okay, the pain spout. Oh no, that hurt. Let's see what special things Peach has. She has therapy, heal HP and status. Oh, that'd be perfect. Or group hug, heal the group's HP and status. Okay, so let's try that over Malo and see if that makes it so that Malo can actually wake up. Yeah, thanks. Perfect, so we'll have Mario defend because I want Malo to do the thought peek on Mastodon. All right, 155 HP left. You're master doomed. Oh no, okay, I blocked it. We'll see who's really doomed. 16 damage, not gonna do too much, but this will, 108 more, just a little bit more here with the double punch and that should knock you out. So two new enemies to take on there, very interesting. Okay, so um, what does this flower do? Good question. Um, Looks like something over here. Hi, you're so cute. Um, are you an, oh, you're an enemy, you're adorable. The Throfer, <laughs> so cute. So maybe now's a good time to uh, try some other stuff. I mean, I guess for right now, we'll do that attack. We will, I'll have Mario defend because I just really want, yeah, you to do this. Got it. What will that do? Why are you picking on me? I'm sorry. <laughs> now I feel really bad. Ah, oh, couldn't quite block that in time. Okay, I blocked it, just not a full block. Let's go ahead and finish off one of them. I wanted to use the special soon. We're lucky. Ooh. 
and that should finish off the other. See ya, Throwfers. All right, very easy enemy so far. Double your experience, sure we'll do it. Where's Yoshi? Still in the middle. Got it. So, from six to 12, right? Yep. And what about you? Hi. Uh, I hope my baby's cute. <laughs> Me too. What will this one do? Whoa, hey, hey, what are you doing here? Two more new enemies, we got Sackett and Pulsar. All right, so first off, I'll attack the Pulsar. Doesn't do much, uh-oh. Okay, couldn't quite, wow, a one hit takedown on Malo. Not good, Um, and the Sackett ran away. So you know what, let's just go ahead and try to get rid of this guy, if we can, that didn't do much. Okay, that luckily missed. Poor Malo. Well, let's make sure that you get healed up this next round, because that was not good. So, uh, I guess for now, I mean, we got two of these activated. It looks like there's more around right over here. I guess we have to have, activate them all to open up the keyhole, and then we can try to fight Chu Ken, or not. Um, can't wait to start a family. So I guess maybe these are all just like different witches. Okay, this is a special thrifter. So let's go and try the special with the healing rainbow. Rainbow power greatly heals everyone, can even revive downed allies. I wanna try this out, because Malo really needs it. It's a stormy day, but Malo is ready for the super heal! Whoa! So cool! And a beautiful rainbow in the sky. That was amazing! All right, whoa, okay, that missed. So we got to see another special effect there. Always glad to see that. Uh, Peach still took some damage, unfortunately, but this is where we can maybe do some stuff. Let's just try beating you up, hitting the other two, and then maybe we could try Shocker. Actually, let's do, no. Um, well, actually, yeah, I haven't thought peaked the Pulsar. So here's my chance. Got it. By the stars, you'll regret hitting me. Uh oh, speaking of which, ah! Okay, Peach, let's go ahead and do therapy on yourself, if you can. There we go. Not bad. You can't really block that. A little unfortunate. Uh, from behind? What are you up to? Uh, <laughs> miss me. Weird. Okay, back to Mario. Back onto the Throfer. And then, Let's do Thunderbolt, just like this. That's gotta do some good damage, right? Not enough to attack you all the way. Poor Peach can't even block against that. She gets knocked out. Let's switch you out with, uh, I guess for now we could do Bowser. And then we will just attack you with everything we got. Definitely wanna play more with Gino today though, if possible. Uh, yikes. So, let's attack again. Getting rid of the Throfer. We still have these other two though. There's our, our coin. I might just do the Thunderbolt again. Not bad, I mean the Gecko has resistance to it, but it's just gonna run away. Okay, this has been pretty tough so far. We do get some extra experience and stuff though, so that's good. And I think that's most of these activated, right? Why is the door still not opening? Did I miss one? Hmm. Oh, I can go beyond it, okay. What about you? I wish I weren't such a crybaby. This one's private. Who do you think you are spying on other people's wishes? Come on, our quest for the star pieces is important. Everyone's counting on us, we've gotta hurry. I would have never guessed it was yours if you didn't say anything. Sorry about that, it's just that I'm embarrassed about my wish. It's okay. We all wish we had some things that are different about ourselves, but it's nothing you can't work on and improve. Wait a minute, we got you. Okay, whoa. Let's see what we wanna do here. I'll attack the Master Doom first. And then we'll have Malo do Thought Peak on Sackett. Okay. Let's see. I can't help being roguish. It's how I am. All right. Let's see what we can do. We can do Terrorize. I haven't done this in a while. Oh yeah, I gotta. I always forget this is the one I have to like, wiggle the analog stick with. But there we go. Decent damage, but the blizzard. That might hurt a little bit. And then the socket runs. 132 damage to use, pretty nice though. There we go, you win. Seven experience, the mid mushroom. 
we might want to take that opportunity to heal up now. So if we go to our, uh, I guess we don't have any normal mushrooms anymore. I'll have to go get some more. Cause I don't want to use this and not even restore the full health. That'd be a little tricky. Okay, so we'll keep running around for now. Looks like there's still a few more enemies abound, but I activated the, all this. It looks like we can move through this little keyhole now and see what's on the other side. Oh, so yeah, we're just going farther in. More stars to talk to. I hope I become famous. All right, we'll go and take on some more enemies in the meantime. Um, it looks like we just have two Thropers, which is pretty easy to take on, I think, at the least. That was pretty good, damaging down one of them. And then Bowser can knock out the next one. Got the 10 chain, looking good. Our gauge is up. I wanna fill that up and then switch over to Peach and Gino and see what that's like. But maybe I'll put Gino on right now and Gino gonna level up too. Gino reached level 11. And we learned the new move, Gino Whirl. Attacks an enemy, press A prior to contact for a critical hit. Uh, let's go ahead and get you just, I guess, higher up on magic. That might be good. Always have a hard time deciding. Hard time keeping up, but uh, let's see. I'll get Gino over Bowser and keep trying this. And we'll heal up Princess Peach pretty soon, I'm sure, but uh, in the meantime, went over there. There's another flower to interact with here. And is this the one we came out of? I think so, yeah. There's another Throfer. The hunger, oh, for some food. Oh, I hope they can get some food soon. Whoa, okay, we got all these guys again. Let's start with Gino. And Gino has to move the Gino World. Attacks enemy, press A prior, or the Gino Boost. Attack a push, push I just before. We have seen the uh, Gino Boost. Let's try the Gino World. Ooh. Did that work? At least not the special, but it was still a really strong attack, so that's cool. Um, doesn't look like there's anything new for Mario. So we'll just hit you with a regular hammer. And then, do this. Nice, able to hit one and knock out the other. Always prefer that. Whoa, okay, couldn't block that in time. I'll just do a normal attack to damage you down and knock you out, and we're good to go. All right, 11 experience is pretty nice. And then uh, down here, we got this one. Okay, more of those guys running around. Oh my, oh my. This area is actually pretty big. I wanna be the best treasure hunter in the world. You have to compete with Captain Toad. Activate another star thing. There's you over here. And another one. And I guess we'll talk to you. Please let Malo find his way home. Why, this wish is, it's for my mom and dad. They're wishing for me to come home. This isn't the time to be crying. They're waiting for me to come home. Come on, Mario. We've got a busy schedule to keep. I'll make you eat dust if you don't hurry. Huh. So I guess maybe Malo's parents are out there wishing for him to come home. Maybe we can grant that wish too. Okay, I don't see too much else going on in this corner of things. I guess I could take on another guy. It's just one little throw for her. So a one hit takedown is all we need. Sorry, little guy. There we go, we win, we get one more coin. And is there any more of these to activate this one right here? Have we interacted with this one? I want to be a Vald class baker. <laughs> All right, well, I guess that's the chef from the, the, the wedding. I guess we're just going right back through here then. Isn't this where we came through? No, I guess not. All right, I'll activate this one here. It's a little bit of a maze, isn't it? <laughs> Whoa, watch it. Uh, if I could just get that melody. That's gotta be uh, Todovsky. Okay, two more throw first. Got you a little bit. And then Mario can do that. Okay, Malo, your chance. Nice, 82 damage there. And there we go. So we win, we get six experience, double our coins. I could use some more coins. So there she's in the middle for now. And on the right. So we get four coins instead. Awesome. Uh, wish I could run faster. <laughs> Maybe that was Boshi. I wanna help out my older brother Mario. Oh, it's a Luigi wish, it's so cute. 
<laughs> All right, well, maybe we can run into Luigi at some point, I don't know. And there's the purple star. Wait, really? No way. It's just chilling out here. It's gone. Wait, is it? I don't know. This is suspiciously easy. Um, I mean, I'm not complaining, that's for sure. Our first star is a group of five. Look at this. Quite the accomplishment. So our fourth star in total, three more to go. That was really weirdly easy. So a star piece fell here after all. Where to next then? I think there's a place called Seaside down up ahead. I hear that it's busy, a busy resort town, so the people there might know something. Let's go see. Okay, so I definitely wanna do that, but before we do, you've come a long way, but your journey's not over yet. There are three more star pieces. Let's get to it. I do wanna see, we're at 188 coins. I definitely wanna get more coins. Obviously the best way to do that is to fight more enemies. Uh, but I guess there's not really too many more to fight around here. This was an odd area, I thought there'd be more to it. But uh, I could try for at least a little bit more here. We'll try the Geno Beam against you. All right, ready? Hold A for power, let it go, boom. Hit you for 144. Mario, let's go ahead and do, I guess, super jump? I might just wanna actually do hammer. Still does a lot of damage, it's still very reliable. Oh, couldn't block that in time though. Oh, I couldn't block that either. Malo, go ahead and do Thunderbolt. I, my extra thing didn't work there. Oh, I can't block this, not good. Didn't time that perfect, but you are still kicking. Mario's gonna be asleep here or something. He's snoozing. I blocked that one though. Okay, cool. That wasn't so bad. We still have these other two to deal with. Blocked it. Got that one, so it's just now the gecko. All right, and they're running off. So, we get 11 experience, 14 coins. Want to double your coins? Yes, I do. Hopefully we can keep the coins. That seems pretty easy. It was just on the right, there you go. So we get 28 coins, that'll help us jump up a lot. Because what I want to do is get to marry more. We needed 200 coins, so we're actually at a perfect opportunity for that. If we go, over here to Marymore, there was an inn there that was like super expensive. I couldn't quite afford it, but now I can, and I wanna see what that's like. All right, so we'll go back up here. And I guess, um, talk to you, right? Hold on, right over here. So, I like to rest a while. Yes, I see. We here at Marymore Hotel are offering a very special deal for a limited time only. If you choose to stay in our lovely deluxe suite, you shall receive a once in a lifetime gift. So. 200 coins for the suite, let's give it a try. Oh, excellent choice, sir. We shall attend you in a minute. Interesting. Sir, this is the gift we promised you upon selection of the suite. We hope you enjoy it. A flower tab, okay. The bellhop will show you to your room. Please enjoy your stay. So we've got a lot of flower tabs before, but I'm glad to get some more. They're always very helpful to have. So we will head right over here and I guess beat them there. <laughs> cool. Whoa, this is the room? Please make yourself at home. Please feel free to use this terry cloth bathrobe after bathing. And please be sure to turn the lights off when going to sleep. Ring the bell for room service. Anything else, sir? Looks like he wants a tip. Will you give him one? Sure, why not? Thank you very much, sir. Please enjoy your stay here. And, well, it's too small for you, oh no. At your service, sir, how may I help you? I'm thirsty. Here's the menu. Pick me up 10 coins, Coraca Cola 150. Okay, I can only afford the pick me up. We spent all of our money for the room. Sir, you seem to be a few coins short. Please ring again. Now I shall be on my way. All right, I'm so sorry. Okay, so we can, we can press that to, I think, uh, go to bed, but what's in here? Oh, is this the bathroom? <laughs> yeah. Mario's taking a shower. And he's whistling the Mario theme from Super Mario Bros. His face is all red too from the hot shower, that's so funny. 
Okay, so, um, does it stay that way for a long time? Let's go ahead and take a nap if we can. Do I have to stand on it? I thought I did to take a rest, but maybe it's not like it is in Mario's house. Huh. So maybe there's not really much more I can do here. Which would be weird, because I didn't get to heal. Now there's gotta be a way to be able to go to bed. Huh. I'm very confused. Hi. Looks like he wants a tip. Sure. You're a little short of coins. <laughs> Please enjoy your stay. <laughs> Sorry. Maybe now I can? There we go, it's because he was in the room. All right. And now it's morning, so that should at least heal us all up. All right, and we're back up. I did notice that this is to the side now. You've paid for only one night's stay. Would you like to stay longer? Uh, yes. <laughs> that's so weird, wait. I don't have the coins for this. I only paid for one night's stay, but... How many coins do I have now? Six. It's interesting that you can stay for longer even though it's very clear I'm not supposed to. <laughs> weird. All right, so we're heading out of there. And there wasn't really too much more I wanted to do here at Marymore. At least that I know that it's available. Sir, you seem to have stayed two times for the price of just one night. I'll have to receive 100 coins for each night you've extended your stay. Uh-oh. Wait a minute. You're broke! I have no choice but to make you work for the remaining amount. Oh no! What do we do? Uh... I guess we're working. <laughs> this is awkward. Um... I just stand here. I can't move. Am I supposed to be able to do something? I'm so confused. Uh, oh, I guess maybe they need help and I'll be able to help them. I'm really confused. I just have to stand here. Is this just the penalty? Is that I just have to sit and wait? I have to test my patience? Okay, well that's very funny. It is other people are coming by. I mean, it's really not much working off our pay, it's just standing around. And honestly, like it's broken and I'm supposed to be doing this? I don't think that's the case. I think it's sort of supposed to be a joke. Bellhop, escort this guest to over to our site. I can help with that. I don't want to be a bother, but could you please help me out? Yeah, sure, right up here. All right, yep, just up these stairs. And here we are. I feel like we're just taking the job of the smaller toad. I want to be so pleased that we're them. So of course there's our bathroom. The bathroom's over here, and that's it. Thanks a lot. <laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait. Can I go back in? It's locked. I was gonna say, can I go and sleep another night and get in trouble again? Will that, will that solve everything? Are you happy now? Please see our guest out. Um. Oh, there you are. So they were. Oh wait, is it you? Remember to do a good job. Uh, okay, isn't this just splendid? This place is even, or heaven for even the rich and famous. Okay, so, please get to work. I'm trying to. Uh, now don't you ever spend another night here without any money. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> but hey, that was really neat. I don't think I would have stumbled upon that if I didn't try to, so that was definitely interesting. So is there anything more to do around here? I really don't know, because the only thing I know is that one of the toads, I feel like reference a casino or something in Marymore, but it's like, they don't know where it is. I definitely don't see a casino anywhere around here. So maybe I misunderstood or something like that. But unless there's you know something hidden somewhere I just don't know of. Doesn't seem like it. So we can head out of here and back to the map and sort of see what's next for us. All right, so. Looks like there's a lot going on, but we need to head back up here, past Star Hill, and over to Seaside Town. All right, we've made it to Seaside Town. This place looks cute. So, what's going on around here? First off, we have, I think, another inn. Whoa, you feeling okay? This is the inn. You may stay for free. Thanks. Uh, okay. I guess we're taking another nap. This is peculiar. Uh, were they watching us sleep? Oh no, they ran away. You get back here. <laughs> what was up with that? Uh, maybe we'll save for now too, that might be a good idea. So, uh, we'll just save right here. And keep it moving. 
This is the inn. You may stay for free. <laughs> I'll pass for now. The other one was hundreds of coins. This one free. <laughs> Sometimes deals are better if you just move a few towns over, I suppose. So that was odd. Why are they all blue? You may not enter here. This is a restricted area. Something's odd. There's nothing of interest here. Don't bother looking inside. Hey, someone's in there. Okay, can I go in? Wait a minute, I can't, okay, I can't go through this one. Odd. Well, what can we do around here? Is there any other buildings I can try to enter? Can I get into the chimney? Not quite, okay. Maybe I can just enter these buildings normally. They have little mushroom icons, which usually means an item store. I'm just a customer. Don't tell me you want supplies. I know. Okay, what can we buy from you? Nothing I can afford, but there's a throw for cookie. Muku, 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 muka. A uh, poison mushroom poisons an enemy. And then the fire bomb and the uh, ice bomb. That's all that they have, but actually interesting wares. Thank you very much. Definitely have to come back once we earn more coins. I feel like right now, grinding enemies wouldn't even be that valuable for the experience, but more so for the coins. In the middle of the ocean is a pirate ship. You'll find a, oh no, I could take too soon. <laughs> You'll find something there. A pirate lives there. His name is Jonathan Jones. He isn't very nice. Jonathan Jones. A star has fallen to the sea. The pirate, probably. I mean that man, uh, Jonathan Jones, probably has it. He's nasty. So there's a Jonathan Jones we'll have to keep in mind. And there's more item shops. Okay, this one's empty. Wait, 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 no it wasn't. Hold on. Uh, hi, what are you doing up here? You're collecting stars, right? Only three more to go. We're getting close. But how did they know that? Word spreads fast in the Mushroom Kingdom. If you want to enter the ocean, jump into the whirlpools. No, wait, I wasn't done. Uh, what about you? You will find the village elder in his house. He is the most respected person here. Okay, let's try this one. Hi, the keep spinning and spinning. They do. <laughs> Can we interact with them at all? I guess not. Lots of odd toads around here. And we could go up this way. I don't know if there's really too much of interest for us up here. There is another building to enter. Is this gonna be the, yeah, the mayor, or the elder? Finally, it took you long enough. I am the elder of this village. I got to my exalted station in life by pleasing my superiors, which is something I do well. A star has fallen into the ocean. I need it for a certain purpose. You must find it for me. Okay. Well, hey. Who are you? Hello there, you're Mario, right? Do you remember me? We met at Tadpole Pond when I was a, still a tadpole. Oh, you were the one who wanted to become a musician. I've graduated from this Frog Sage's school, and now I'm searching for the meaning of life. It's been so quiet around here, it's almost eerie. Is something going on? It probably doesn't concern me, but if you have any frog coins, I've got some neat items to sell. We got the Sia for 10, Run from battles, using this will not consume it. Oh wow, okay. Go ahead and get that then. Earlier times, use it, use it to start a battle over. Using this will not consume it. Interesting, so these are like reusable items. We also, whoa, have some other really interesting stuff that I do not have enough for. The experience booster, which doubles experience when equipped. The coin trick doubles the coins you win in battle and flowering cuts FP use in half during battle. Very crazy stuff there. Definitely worth considering later on, but for right now, I wanna get out of here and uh, keep exploring around a little bit more. So as we get more of the frog coins, I'll definitely wanna come back here and spend them. I don't see too much else to do around here, so maybe we should, there was another path up here. We should go through that just to see what it is. It might just lead back to the map. No, it doesn't. So what's going on out here? Uh, whole bunch of nothing. That's what it seems like. That's odd. Maybe we'll have to come back at some point. So we'll go to the map. And the map wants us just to go out to the sea. Uh, what if I do this? Can I go to the actual? Okay, it gets me back to the entrance, which is convenient. So instead of seaside town, let's try the sea. Uh, all right, 
we're at the sea. And I guess I could just use it to jump back up. We needed to, but instead, are we in the sea or are we under the sea right now? Just like in a cave. So spooky in here. I don't like it. Oh, hello. Been a while since people came around here. You wanna buy or sell? We don't have much to buy with, but I guess they do provide some items. Um, new things are gonna be like the party cleanse. Party is refreshed during battle. We also have the, the uh, Hurley Glove, a classic Mario toss attack, um, and the sailor shirt, pants, cape, and dress. Gotcha, so we'll definitely have to equip some of that stuff soon, but not now. Thank you, drop by again. So what's down this way? Whoa, somewhere to the save, so we'll definitely take that opportunity. And I can't get over there, at least not from here, so we'll have to find another way around. Maybe just over this way? So spooky. Um, Got some starfish chilling out. Oh, and they're enemies, I can fight them. Uh, the Zeo Star, interesting. Okay, let's go ahead and do that. Get some damage in. And then I'll finish you off with Mario, and then have Malo thought peek the other Zeo Star. Let's see what they're thinking. Can you believe I got get confused with those no good star slaps? Oh my. Uh, <laughs> they're doing a little dance, that was so cute. <laughs> Unfortunately, they gotta get knocked out now. That was this adorable little hip shake. All right, so that was pretty good. And we filled up our gauge, which might be a fantastic opportunity to switch up our party and check out a new um, triple move. So instead of Malo, we'll do Peach and try the Spare Us All. A Shining Veil protects the whole party from any one attack. Or I could do this one, the Shooting Star Shot. Shooting stars rain on foes from the sky while boosting allies. I wanna try this one out because um, it's more of an attack focused one. Whoa, and we got some new enemies, of course. We got the Lucos, which I guess I'll check them out later. For right now, I mean, I guess I could switch at any time, can I? I don't know why I thought I couldn't. Uh, let's just try out this triple move, the Shooting Star. Whoa! Whoa, he's throwing him up! And flying right back down! Oh man! That is so cool! Huge damage raining in on everyone! That was fantastic. All right, so I can't switch now, but I can hit the Zeo Star just like that. Okay, now we can switch. So I can switch over to Malo, and then Malo can use Thought Peak. So it's actually not too bad just to switch over like that. There we go. And what are you thinking? Let's face it, I can't keep drifting forever. I don't think you can do anything forever. Okay, I blocked that one. Still not enough to take you out though, you're pretty tough. Okay, ready? Hitting you, and I knocked both of them out with that, fantastic. Very cool. So, you win, we get some extra coins and experience, and Peach gets a level up. Put honey syrup in the storage box, that's always good. So, let's see what Peach can get. This might be Peach's first level up. All right. So, definitely wanna get her more HP, because she is pretty low on HP, so I think I'm gonna do that for a few levels for her. But there we go. And there's more I can take on. If there's even a chance of running into new enemies, I definitely want to. So let's go with this again. I think I will just keep with Gino here, but then maybe switch Malo out for Bowser, just so that we can get a more attack focused situation. Okay, once again. Oh, that's really good, actually. We'll hit the Zeo Star. Big damage all around, knocking at the other Zeo Star again. All right, L Luco. Knock you out a little bit more. And then Malo, switch you up with Bowser. And that wasn't so bad. Yeah, there we go. Can't block this static electricity. But maybe that wasn't so bad. The double takedown again. HP's maxed out for Gina, which is actually fantastic because they were getting a little low. And Mario levels up. I haven't, I don't know if I've seen Princess Peach's dance, but it's so cute. The whole party now dancing around. I do think that we do have all the characters you can get in this game now. Are you reached level 12? And this time, I would like physical damage. I just feel like maxing out on that's been so helpful. And Mario leveled up, I didn't even realize. Mario reached level 12, extra magic damage for sure. And Bowser was a triple. How did I not even realize? Definitely, I would only be one HP. That doesn't feel like such a good boost, right? Compared to, you know, extra attack and defense or extra magic would be a couple more points, right? I don't know, we'll just do physical attack. And 
What about down here? We got a special Zeo Star. Okay, my timing wasn't the best for that. They're just gonna recover <laughs> with a little dance. Got that one pretty well. Nice, okay. Almost have these guys dealt with. Oh, you healed your friend, huh? Let's try something different then. Uh, Let's just try the Geno Beam against you. Really try to hit you with this. Perfect. 156 is pretty damaging. 128 there is enough to knock you out so we get an extra frog coin. And we get you knocked out too. Excellent, we're making things work. So, right down this way. I'm taking on like as many enemies as I can because I really want more coins and stuff. There we go, we hit everybody with that one and we're able to get rid of the Zeo Star straight away. Got that too. And once again. There we go. And then Bowser. Didn't hit both of them, unfortunately. I really want to change up the Chain Chomp move to something else, but it's the strongest thing we have for now. Getting rid of you. And then Mario can uh, hit you with the hammer. Got it. All right, so with that done, 20 experience, 12 coins, and a mushroom. Still more. I'll go for one more fight here. There's just a lot of enemies around. We get a blooper! Awesome! So, let's first just immediately switch over to Malo and Thought Peak the blooper. So cool. What is the blooper thinking about? Uh, I need to go spray my dishes. Always has chores on the mind. Okay, I blocked that one decently enough. Damaging you guys down a little bit. Ah. Whoa. Blocked it, nice. Ah, uh, not quite for that one. Mario, go ahead and knock these two out like that, right? Okay, once again. There it is. Okay, not bad, we make our way through. And wanna double your coins? Yes, I do. The more coins I can get, the better, because there's a lot of shops right now that have like extra stuff for us. I think I'll just be in the middle. There we go, so we're going from six to 12 coins. And slowly stacks this up. And oh, I got the superstars. Now I can knock these guys out without too much of an issue. We'll continue in the next room. It will, okay. More enemies to knock out, go, go, go. It's just sort of weird, because it doesn't actually get me anything extra, but it looks like there's a hidden little room back here. Oh yeah, we got that. Some extra stuff there too. I could go back if I wanted to. You know what, sure, I'll go and save. So we knocked out all those enemies anyways. Everybody's pretty healed up in the moment, and I do have enough coins, I think, to at least buy a little something, right? Um, let's see. First things first, I got the party cleanse. That's 50 coins out. Or I could buy, or I could keep saving for the Hurley Glove, you know? Or, over here, this stuff I can afford, and it would actually be improvements. I think that maybe the Sailor's Dress would be good for Peach, so we could get this one now. I'll go and equip it straight away, just to make sure that she actually has something, because I don't think she does. Since you shopped here, I'll tell you this. The ship sank into the briny sea because a giant squid attacked it. Some people went in to survey it, but they never came back. Spooky. All right, let's continue through, just like this. And we were just right over here. What's going on now? Oh, we can hop in the water. Oh, I remember it saying that the whirlpool will bring us farther ahead, which is good because I can't jump back up. Whoa! Okay, so it'll make us sort of stuck to the bottom of the water, and then we can go into the cave. Whoa. And then maybe we could just swim back up. And now that we have, up here, we get a max mushroom. That's gonna be useful sooner or later. And we're outside of the cave now. Anything over here? Not really, so we're back in the water. I can swim around at the surface a little bit if I wanted to. I don't know if there's really too much to do on the actual surface though. Just has me curious before we go deeper in. Cause there's the big pirate ship. Oh. Um. It doesn't quite seem like it. Are you gonna try to get me here? All right, we'll go down just like this. 
Here come those bloopers. We didn't fight them before, you know, we can fight them now. Let's go for it. <laughs> Weird that there's no music here. Whoa, we got a cheap cheap here of some sort. Okay, blocked it, but not a full block. Mr. Kipper. <laughs> All right. Got it. It's gonna knock out the blooper. Very lucky. Malo can do Thaw Peak on Mr. Kipper. And bloop, flop, don't get caught. All right. Getting caught doing what exactly? Who knows? We're knocking you out. I think it got caught. Safe to say. All right. Double your experience. Why not? It's gonna be on the right, so I'll take that opportunity and keep moving. So 14 experience is pretty nice. Another blue pro I'm just gonna go for you. What is this thing? It's like a big robotic. Uh oh, oh no. Uh. Crusty, big robotic crab, very creepy. Here. We'll do that really quickly. Knock out one of them, get the lucky. Go to Malo, of course, Thought Peak on Crusty. Ooh. What do we get? Floppy Floop in a netted hoop. Okay, let's get rid of you then. Not bad. Uh, I don't know if I can block that. I don't know what that does really. Oh, that was a perfect block. Nice, we're doing really good now. Let's hit you again. We finished off Krusty. Malo can do that, finish you off. And then lastly, Bowser over here. It's something, it's something. Another battle cleared up. So with that done, we get the honey syrup. We can double our experience. Don't mind if I do watch the Yoshi. Right in the center. 38 experience, wow. Any level ups? We do get a level up for Gina. Gina reached level 12. Will up your physical. And Peach as well, getting a level up. Everybody's getting stronger here. I think once again, oh, Peach learned a new move, Sleepy Time, Zonquan or Morphos. Let's go ahead and up her HP one more time. And we're back to it. What's with these little shells? Can I pick these up? Oh, they bring me back up. Good to know. Was there anything else on or near the surface of the water that I should point my attention towards? It really doesn't look like it. So I can go all the way down here, but it doesn't really do anything. Okay, so I think we're good just to try to get into this pirate ship then. Way down here. Unless there was anything at the surface, which I wasn't looking for. Really, really doesn't seem like it. Sorry if I'm being a little bit over thorough for such a barren area. I just wanna make sure so we don't have the come back later for something that I could have gotten now. And is there anything on the ship? Doesn't look like it. Going down. All right, we're in the sunken ship. And there's a letter. There's a page from a travel log. Let's take a look at it. We're done for. A giant squid just got a hold of us. The ship's going down fast. Oh no. See, so yeah, that's what made the ship sink. What's in here? Whoa, hey, these are new. Um, Can I fight you? They're spooky. We got scythes, all sorts of new enemies. All right, we got the Creeper, the Straw Head, and the Reacher. Uh, First things first then, it's gonna hit you with the hammer. There we go. Malo, do Thought Peak on the Creeper. What are you thinking about? Can I have just a tiny bit of your soul? No, Uh, attack. Got it. Not bad. Ooh, be careful of that. I blocked all of them. Mario, go ahead and use this against Straw Head. Oh, that's enough to knock you out. I still need to do a uh, Thought Peak on that, but the Reacher, well, you had the chance. What do we get here? More and more, I've been thinking about returning to the soil. <laughs> all right, well, we might be able to help you out with that one. Oh, uh oh, I blocked it. Got it, 136 damage there. It's gonna knock you down. And our gauge is up. It's already maxed out, but cool. We win 20 coins and experience and some pure water. That was cool. Um, There's a page from a travel log. Let's take a look at it. The door to the cellar is locked with a six letter password. To get inside, you'll have to figure out the password using the six hints. Huh, I mean right now I just see the letter J everywhere, so maybe that has something to do with it. But let's fight another one here. 
Okay, so it's the same as before. So maybe I could do a thing or two. Ow, that hurt. Attack the Creeper first. Have Malu do Thaw Peek on Strawhead. So we fought an enemy like this before in the sewers, but I think it was different. It was like a different color. Whenever I reach out my hand, there you are. Okay, so which combo have we not done? I think it was with Peach and Gina, right? Or actually also with Bowser too. So I'll do this for now. Oh no, oh no. That hurt a little bit, we're poisoned. <laughs> They're playing some creepy tunes. I blocked it, ooh, that was good. Okay, so Mario, go ahead and get rid of the creeper. And what we'll do is we'll switch out Malo for Peach, and then we'll do the triple move, which is Starry Shell Spike. A spinning shell charged with star power hits all enemies hard. Let's give it a try. Whoa, here we go. Whoa, the super star powered Bowser shell slams down. That was so cool. All right, and we'll finish you off, right? There it is. That was amazing. So we win. And we can keep moving. So what's going on down this way? Oh, dry bones, huh? Um, I can talk to this one. I know, you probably said to yourself, it's just a pile of dusty old bones. Think again. Oh no, ah! All right, we got dry bones now, so I'll switch out Peach once again for Malo, just so that I can use the Thaw Peak on them. What do we got? Uh, put me together, I fall apart. I always have them, one or more. <laughs> All right, so that probably means we need to defeat both of them fairly quickly. Because if we defeat one, the other might rebuild itself. I am not doing a good job of blocking. Okay, ready? They are still keeping it together pretty well. That was still good, but we need more. Okay, we missed that one. Ah, blocking is not working out super well. This doesn't seem like it's really doing much. How much health do they have? Maybe I should thought peek them again. That time I blocked it. All right, Mario, try just to jump. Okay, that got rid of you. So maybe we're just almost done with them. Or maybe it has to be a jump. Weird. Ugh, all right, jump. Yeah, that just makes you disappear straight away. So it might just be that we have to do the jump. All right, Bowser got a level up though, so that's always good. He seems pretty happy, level 12. We get the new move, Poison Gas, Poison Foes, and we'll get you, because of that, a magic up. Okay, there's so many more item enemies to fight, but I'll jump on you, and it'll be two more dry bones. So first things first, I'll try yeah, it just instantly defeats you. That's crazy. So what if I tried you know, some kind of special move here? Would that get rid of you? It's your weakness, so yeah, I guess so. Interesting, I just wasn't doing it really well before, but it's okay, we get some pure water. Oh, but you're back, right? Or you will be back. Okay, so let's not worry about it too much for the time being. There's a page from the travel log. Let's take a look at it. Uncover the six, oh, secret of the six hints. Since they're provided by different people, they'll be tough to solve. Maybe impossible. Huh, that's definitely weird. Can I get up here? No. What's going on in this next room? We got these little mice again. Are these the same rat funks or are they different? Uh, ah, they're alley rats. Okay, and the enigmax are different too. I guess for right now, we'll hit one of these guys. I missed, darn. Okay, Malo, you're not doing so well. Um. Let's do Thought Peak on Alley Rat. Ooh. What's the big Mario guy doing, doing looking at a little on me? I think he's, whoa. Oh, thinking about hitting you with the hammer. Oh no. Ah! What did that do? Oh, Mario block it, no! Okay, this is becoming a little bit of an issue. Let's go ahead and use Poison Gas, Poison Foes. Let's try it out. I mean, that might not work. 
or take L for more damage. It's a big cloud. Whoa, that might not have any effect on these guys at all. Or actually it did. Okay, you're just gonna run. Let's go ahead and have, oh, we got the shocker, shocking me. No, no, we already had that. Yeah, never mind. I can heal like this, but it wouldn't be too good, would it? I mean, I guess. Okay, let's see. It gets us back up the full, but I'm still poisoned, but I blocked that. I did not block that in time. No, I did. Got you a little bit, but we definitely need more. I missed, darn. Okay. Didn't get the perfect block, but the Will of Wisp, also not working for me too well. Come on, got one of them. And I got some decent damage there. Getting a little bit closer. Come on. Closer and closer. There we go. Tough battle for sure. But we win. I think now might be a good time to uh, maybe do a little switch, something like, no, no, no. Like this, see how that goes. So we're coming in from this way. Well, hey, I found a flower, that's nice. And speaking of which, we are a little low on our FP. Let's go ahead and raise it by one, like that. Okay, there's more of these guys. I'm trying to avoid them, but I run into another. All right, we got the Greepers. We got a lot of stuff going on here. 76 damage. Let's have Peach do a group hug, maybe? Hmm. Well, actually, let's just do this for Mario. Okay, there we go. Almost back up the full. Mario seems pretty happy about it. Ah, blocked it. Nice, that was at least good. Even if Mario still does take some kind of damage. Let's have Mario attack the alley rat a little bit. And have Gino attack the other one. There we go. Oh, I missed, unfortunate. Oh, I didn't time that well. Can't block the blizzard, but it does still do a lot of damage. It's a little bit better. And that's you knocked out, so hopefully we can work on you a little bit more. Here comes another blizzard, which really seems to be hurting Mario. The difficulty of the game is certainly stepping up a bit more. Got it. Okay, so with that done, we win. We get a lot of extra stuff there, and Mario, Seems pretty happy. Mario is level 13. And you know what? Let's go ahead and up his, uh, I wanna mine some more magic defense with like, all the stuff we're getting. So I'll, I'll get that. Whoa, running right at me. It doesn't say that there's any secret boxes here. So if all, as long as I can just find the ones that I can see, this one will get me some extra coins. All right, quite a lot. Oh, we're good to continue. Definitely feels like quite the maze so far. I'll go ahead and fight you a little bit. Just one simple Greeper. I think we can handle that. One hit takedown is all we need. That's actually fantastic. So, five experience. I go through this door. Now we're over here. What's up with the floating button? Creepy, oh no. Um, The ball fell over. What do I do? This doesn't seem right, does it? Are there invisible blocks or something? Or maybe it's dependent on where I stand. Will that rock the boat, so to speak? So if I were to do this? I don't know. I th that's what it seemed like I did? Huh. I don't know what made the ball fall, but it fell in a different direction than the second time. What if I get up here again? Yeah, what made it fall, I wonder? I'm really not quite sure. If only the Koopa could hit it. <laughs> Is that the idea? How did it fall the first two times? That, see, it's just so weird. I'll try one more time, but if not, maybe we can come back. Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe if I get him, there we go, he pushed through it that time, whoa. And we get the Adventurer Indigo's memo. There's an S in the word. Oh, okay, so there's an S in the word. I get a little mushroom there. I figured it out pretty well. 
Okay, so, boom. There's an Aston Ward off to try to keep that in mind. But also, Gino, you wanna take on these guys? Seems like a good idea. Nice, 20 more damage. Oh, ah, oh, couldn't quite block in time. This I can't block. We're almost there to being able to use another special. That was pretty good, knocking out the big guy. We get some defense up. That should almost knock you out. So, I'll peach finish it off. There we go, very nice. Blocked it, and we do have the full gauge for next fight. All right, regular boost there. Very cool. Pick me up, Malo gets a level up too. Looking good, buddy. Yay! <laughs> Malo reached level 13. Everybody does their happy dance. And Malo is gonna go ahead and get a magic upgrade again. So what's inside of this room then? Whoa. Oh, look at these. What will that do? Whoa, whoa, okay. It's like a little puzzle. I mean, obviously, but here, let's uh try to make it so that they all meet up in the right spot. That might be a bit better. I don't know if that was good. Doesn't seem like it, almost though. Two out of three. I think there. So the timing on the last one is what matters the most, I feel. Ah, oh, that's not gonna reach. Darn, that's tough. So it's gotta land right about there. That should be good, right? Yeah? Yeah? Got it. Nice, so we get FP and a little clue. The Adventurer Indigo's memo, or Indigo Junior's memo. It is found on the bed of the ocean. Sand is my first guess, if it has a letter S in its name, and it's at the bed of the ocean, sand might be the answer, but if we go into this next one, so maybe the J on the boxes stands for Junior. Let's go ahead and use our triple move here, especially against a special Griefer. Spare us all. A Shining Veil protects the whole party from any one attack. So this one's a little bit different, but this is the last one we haven't seen so far. Princess Peach readies her parasol. It gets super powerful. Whoa. There we go. So cool. So now we're super protected against any one attack. Like this blizzard. Not a problem. We're able to defend. No, wait. Did we? Yeah, okay. We're defended. Uh, let's have Mario. Oh, no, this is Peach. There we go. Still able to get some slap damage there. That was pretty good. The stench that I can't block. Peach was resistant to it. And the LG. Resistant. Awesome. Let's go ahead and try something like. Ah, uh, I don't know if I should. I mean, I could, I just, actually, let's just do Gino Beam. Charge this up. Got it all the way. Boom, hitting you for 164. And then, I could sunk one or more foes. We haven't tried this yet, so let's try it on the Griefer. Hold or rotate L to, oh, 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 I get it. Ah, I didn't quite realize. That's such a, she a sleepy little sheep. That's so cute. Alrighty. And of course, attacking will wake you back up. We'll get the frog coin for it. And I blocked that perfect, even the peach still gets poisoned. Or maybe that was because of the super effect that we blocked it. I'm not quite sure, actually. 130 there. Just a little bit more. Attack up. Come on, we can get through this. 15 more damage. Okay. Ah, oh, couldn't block that in time. A little unfortunate. 76 damage, knocks you out. That was cool. All right, so we win. Lots more experience left before any more level us. We get the pure water there too. And let's go in the store. So what's our next one? Whoa, crazy maze going on in here, right? Uh, This is definitely peculiar. It's gotta sort of keep a mental map of everywhere we can go, right? So that's a dead end, it's gotta be Somewhere over here, then. Maybe. Uh, <laughs> it's really hard to tell. Now I'm back out here. So, is there any other entrance? Not really. Can't really go up, down, anywhere, there. Wait, wait. 
Was there more? I can't go, oh wait, I can jump up here. Okay, jumped up somewhere. Then I fell back down. Jump up, jump up again maybe? There we go. Uh, I jumped up again, but I can't do anything else. This is so weird. Uh, I feel like we're so close to figuring something out here. And I'm back down here, aren't I? Okay, so I go up to this set end, jump up, then I move to the right, jump up a few more times, but then I can't do anything else from there. Yeah, move in all directions except for the way to go back. Not too much more to do. This is so tricky. Wait, I can give up? I don't wanna give up just yet. I wanna find the solution to the puzzle. Okay, so instead of going two steps up, if I just go one, I end up over here. Okay. And now that I have, whoa, I fell back down. Um, okay. Where do I go from here? I'm back over here, no! Okay, so to go through it all, I go like this, I take a right, I jump up, and I move back towards the right side of the screen, jump up once, then go to the left once, we're up here. What do I do from here then is the question. There's nothing in here, but if I go this way, I fall. What, no, oh, come on, <laughs> are you serious? Let's try that again. Um, Back over, up one, jump over, I don't, I don't think I got it. Uh, So tricky. I think I got it, okay. Um, Just hard to see where Mario is. Okay, so I can, Fall down once, once I do that, it's a little bit of a curious situation of where exactly I am at the moment. Okay, I got up something, I got up something. Uh, okay, I'm somewhere, I'm over here, I made it! Okay, that was a lot of wiggling around towards the end. I get a royal syrup and the second expedition team's memo, it has two vowels. So it can't be sand, because sand only has one vowel, yay. Hmm on the bed of the ocean, has the letter S in it, and has two vowels. A mollusk? I don't know. Um, don't see anything else over here, but we will go this way. Let's see what else we can find. Whoa. Um, I guess first things first, what does a new enemy over there, right? That was one of the ones I was selling us stuff at the beginning. Interesting. All right, we'll go over here and hit you like that 196. Oh, that's right, I gotta jump on these guys. I can hit them all I want, but I won't really do anything. So let's go ahead and get rid of you. Ow, okay, luckily that's not too big of a deal. And we'll try the Geno Beam against you, see if that does anything. It doesn't, oh no, it does. Okay, cool. We found a way to get through. All right, got some pure water. And now I can get this too, some extra coins quickly before this dry bun pops back up. Oh no, oh no. Not good. Okay, there's not much I can do here, is there? <laughs> yeah, I'll just have to fight them again. That's okay. Two more dry bones, same as before. Actually, I wonder if I could run. I mean, I'd have a dead end on where to get to. So, might as well try the Geno Beam. Never mind. Uh, yeah, I guess this doesn't really do too much. I could have taken that opportunity to heal Mario, actually. Jump. Got it. Dry bones is gonna attack. I messed it up. Geno Beam. Does it really even matter how much damage I do? No, it doesn't. So don't have to worry about timing it super well, uh, but we win. Okay, so what about you? Are you an enemy? Oh, you're not. Hey, it's good to see you. Oh, I can buy from you. All right, so what do we have here that we need? The party cleanse is still available. Party is refreshed during battle. Sure, I'll buy one. Um, over here, we still need the Hurley Glove, which will be an increase for Bowser, a classic Mario toss attack. Sure. 92 coins, I can afford it, so we'll do that and we'll equip it. Um, and then we, of course, have the Sailor Shirt for Mario, which gives six defense and magic defense, or three magic defense. Buy that and equip it. Over here, uh, the Sailor Pants for uh, Malo. And then finally, the Sailor Cape for Gino. arguably still not really worth it. I get more defense, magic defense, but I lose attack, magic attack, and speed. So I'll buy it, but I won't equip it. All right, so now we're all caught up with all those. I'll give you a hint, the password's got something to do with the C. Even if you don't get through all six of the obstacles, you can still try to deduce your way through. Good luck. 
All right, well, I would like to go through all the hints just so we can figure it out, but over here, oh my. What do we wanna do? We'll take on the grouper. I think I will try one of these. Got the perfect. Hit you for 172, knocking you out too, which is fantastic. I think we'll do a group hug, because we're all hurting quite a lot. Okay, there we go, all back at the full. Mario now can just uh, hit you with the hammer, 144, knocking you out. Oh no, oh, that hurt. That did a lot of damage. So Peach, you wanna finish him off? Not quite, Mario, you can do it. I feel like we need to up Peach's physical then, for sure, because it just really isn't hitting very hard. All right, so there we go. We got the item to pick me up there. I do wanna check then, for the equip. Peach doesn't have anything right now, right? Oh, she has the slap glove. Wait, yeah, okay, yeah, I definitely want the slap glove, because it gets four the attack. Definitely worth it. Let's go into this door and see what other hint we have. Whoa, we can follow these coins. Wait, was that supposed to be? Oh my, maybe I rushed into that a little too much. Try that again. Okay. If I follow these, I might be able to discover a path that does something. Um, got it. Okay. Cool, I got a bunch of coins, and I get the hint. The search party Onyx's memo. It is very val valuable. Well, a pearl has two vowels at the bottom of the C, but doesn't have an S in it. Pearls? Plural? Does that count? Is that cheating? All right, so let's try this again. Um, got a good attack there, knocking out one of them too. Get the lucky bonus. We'll have Peach go in. Ooh, not bad there. Mario, go ahead and try for the Reacher. A little bit more. I blocked it, it was a perfect block. Ah, oh, that one, not so much. I always get too anticipating with that one. All right, knocked you out. Hopefully Peach can knock out this next one. There we go, excellent. So everybody's getting a little bit stronger. We get pure water, 20 more coins. Double your experience, definitely. Because we get 20, we can get up to 40. Just in the middle. Okay, so with that done, Let's get over here and see what's next. Just one creeper, so I'll get rid of you. I guess I could have gone beyond the door there. Got it. Glad I can finish them all up though. We win. And Peach gets a level up. Awesome, so Peach is level 12. So like I said, let's up her physical because she really doesn't hit for super hard. And let's see what's beyond this door. Uh, whoa. Okay, that launches a cannon. Oh, do I have to, oh no. Um, let's try again. I wonder, oh yeah, 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 okay. I think I see what I gotta do here. I gotta be quick with it. It's not easy, but I jump. Whoa, 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 we did it! That was so cool! This time I get a mushroom and the fourth investigation crew's memo. It is actually a they. Huh, so it's, so it's plural, okay. I think that there's multiple. Is that what it's trying to tell me? Um, so it might be pearls. Okay, what's next? Um, huh, well, let's go ahead and save. Just like this, and I'll just save here, yep. We're still in the sunken ship, so let's keep it moving. So what's next? What does this bun do? Nothing, what does this bun do? Nothing. But if I hit them both at once, maybe that would do something? Can we get a friend over here? No? Weird. Don't know what's up with that, but wait a minute. Once you've come up with the key letter, speak in here. Uh, the pass through here, hit those six box boxes and enter the password. Okay. Before I do that though, I know this might seem a little silly. I might wanna do some quick backtracking. I feel like we might have missed a few things. Um, not in these rooms specifically, but before we got to this, wasn't there like another path? I may be getting it mixed up, but I wanna make extra sure of that case before we go too much farther. So it was back here, right? I could be wrong. I could be totally, totally wrong. I don't know. I'll keep looking and if there isn't, I'll go back over. See, very back at the beginning of the ship, this is how we fell into it. We never went to the door to the right. 
right? This is how he fell into the ship, if I'm not mistaken. It is, so let me go back in there. What is over here at the very, very beginning? Oh, a save spot, that's so funny that I missed this. There's a page from a travel log. Let's take a look at it. We've managed to trap the giant squid in the treasure cellar. The treasure will sink with the ship, but so it goes. So the treasure is still down here, as well as probably a giant squid. All right, now that I've done that and got that little bit of extra information, now we can go all the way back over. Can't believe I missed that. Okay, so I'm guessing that the answer has to be pearls, right? Turlo? Uh, okay, so this is like the letter. So I'm looking for the letter P, right? Um, I'm a little confused. Where is the letter P? Well, key letter one, oh, I see. Okay, wait, key letter one, one, P, E, A, R, L, S. We got it, right? Let's find out. The password you went to, Peasel, or, no? Oh, wait, I did it backwards, wait. Is this five? No, oh, whoops, okay, sorry about that. <laughs> That's not Peasel, or, it's P, E, A, R, L, S. Sorry about that, that shouldn't be the answer. Pearls, we did it! Good job. I'll let you through if you can get past me first, that is, whoa. The squid tentacle popping out of the pipe. Oh my, we're just going right into it. We got the tentacles. Okay, first thing we gotta do then is switch out to, of course, uh, you. So, let's go ahead and do the thought peek on a tentacle. So creepy. Ooh. It is, uh, you're not going to get to beat me, are you? No, I just want the treasure or whatever. We're, we're trying to get to the star, probably. But um, let's go ahead and I guess try this. I feel like it's to switch you out too. Maybe just for Bowser or something. We want like one character that can heal and then another character that can pack a punch, right? Um, and then for special, we could try poison gas. It would be fun. All right, ready? Ooh, no problem. Filled it up all the way that time. I'll poison you guys up. Ooh, that did a bunch. Excellent. Oh, and I got a perfect block too. Yeah, not a problem. Not a problem. Oh, we're so good. All right, let's go ahead and use a special here. We'll try just a normal fireball against one of the tentacles. Ooh, got it. Really nice, it's a weakness too. No, Malo! Where's Malo going? Um, I don't know, can I still use the gauge move? No, it's just a toad assist. I didn't read it, I should have read it. Oh, no. I mean, it's nice to see this again. We get the power mushroom, but not what I needed at all. We got our attack app. Okay, Bowser. Go ahead and use uh, Terrorize this time, just because I'm very curious to see how much damage this will end up doing with the, the boo scaring you. Ooh, not bad, not bad. It's nice to be able to hit them all at once. There we go. That tentacle's gone. Okay, so Malo's back. Whoa, we haven't seen that move yet. That was so cool. We just toss Mario. So what happens if Mario's not there? Do we just toss, I mean, oh yeah, that's right. Mario's always there. That's how the game works. Okay, 96 more damage. And we're stomping through even more. This is crazy. So, Malo is a little scared at the moment, but let's go ahead and try Shocker here. Now let's try Thunderbolt. I guess the timing wasn't right, unfortunate. <laughs> 115 damage to you, no, Malo! Oh, couldn't block that one in time. We'll do that, and then I definitely wanna keep doing the poison, I think. That was, oh, I, I can't afford it at the moment. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> keep throwing Malo up, and I don't appreciate it. Get out of here with that, then. Okay, I squished it, that's good. Um, Bowser, get rid of that. Not happening, buddy, sorry. Another hammer strike, gets us a little bit more through. Whoa, the big pipe with jewels on it, whoa, here he is! That's so spooky, the King Calamari. So let's go ahead and get a thought peek on you straight away, the King Calamari. Oh. 800 health, and it's weak to fire. This ship's mine, scram! We'll see about that. So, first things first, uh, I think I'll actually use this opportunity 
to try, yeah, recover all FP. The Royal Serp, maybe I shouldn't, maybe I should just do a Maple, 40, sure. Yeah, that should be enough. Get that all the way back up. Got a freebie too, what are the odds? So lucky. Uh-oh, Mario, no, I was about to use you. Um, oh no, you're back, okay. So let's try Thunderbolt on all these guys. There we go. Just to damage on the tentacles a little bit, we'll have Bowser do poison gas. Okay. Go, 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 go. No problem. Ooh, resistance from the tentacle. I meant from the King Calamari. But uh, if Mario could just attack here. Ow. We could change that up a little bit. I guess for right now then. Just throwing out a couple of punches. Let's go back with Bowser and Try the Mario attack. Wait, we throw a little toy Mario, that's so cute. Mario's resisting the poison for at least now. Got it. Mario, here's our chance. Let's do the super fireball against King Calamari. And really scorch him up. 174 damage. Now might be a good time to switch things up again. Maybe switch to Geno, or at least I would if they were healed. Um, well maybe we'll switch to Geno and then just heal. That might just be the best bet. Um, that's 30 HP, this is 80 HP. I have a lot of these, so might as well. There we go, feeling a lot better. Bowser. Hitting for 87. We're getting a little farther. Okay, Geno's turn again. Let's try the Geno Beam against, I guess, one of these tentacles. Perfect. And we hit it for 66. Not enough to take it out. Super Fireball against the King Calamari. Perfect, 140 more damage to you. No, Gino! Okay, block that one. We do have a bit of a chain coming up. All right, this is not one of the ones where even if you perfect time it, I don't think you can hit the other's multiple, but maybe I'm wrong. Okay, definitely didn't time that well. Just gonna throw Gino for that one. Sort of don't blame me with how bad I did there. Uh, let's do another one. King Calamari, come on. Keep it going, keep it going. 140, we're getting a whole lot closer, we beat you. It's just the tentacles now. They have minds of their own. Oh no, they're gone. That was crazy. We defeated King Calamari and we win with 34 experience and 100 coins. That was so cool. And we get a level up for Gino too. All right, level 13, everybody's jamming out because of it. Let's go ahead and up your HP a little bit, sure. And now we're here. Whoever here is. Another dry bones. What is this? Anything? I'm a little confused. It's still going. There's more in this ship. Well, if there's more than, I don't know how much longer it goes on for. There's rats all the way up there. Interesting. All right, well, it seems like there's still a lot more to do here in the ship to explore around and maybe find our star. But with that being said, I think for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Super Mario RPG. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.